Hi, Lynn with Travelators here with a Tuesday travel tip. Today's trip is about the federal requirement to have what is called a real ID in your possession by May 3rd of 2023. Now you may have heard about the Real ID Act in the past couple of years. It got kind of delayed by the pandemic. Originally, we were all supposed to have them in 2020 and it kept getting pushed out. Well, they have now established the new deadline of May 3rd, 2023. And what that means is, is you need a new version of your driver's license or a passport to fly domestically. Now I know that sounds a little crazy. Why would you need a passport to fly domestically? But both forms of identification either or ultimately are really verifying your identity and your citizenship. And so if you have a passport, you don't necessarily need a real ID driver's license, but if you would like to not have to carry your passport around, then you will have to go into your DMV and apply for a driver's license that they are calling a real ID. And the difference or what it looks like is that you have a star on your driver's license. And you can see here, I'm showing an example of it. So I'm including links and uh, websites in this video, uh, not only for the federal mandate, but also for Wisconsin. Of course, if you're from a different state, you'll want to look up your state's real ID requirements as they may vary a little bit. But ultimately, when you go in to get your new driver's license, you'll need to bring multiple forms of identification as well as proof of residency. Again, we've got some time to do this. May 3rd of 2023 is the deadline. And take a look at these resources for more information.